we're about to start this reconstructive rhinoplasty so you can see that the patient's nose is totally collapsed in the middle third of the face the patient also has a condition called as nasomaxillary hypoplasia we're going to be reconstructing the septum augmenting the pyriform rim obviously the radix dorsum and the tip we've harvested costochondral graft of rib we're using both the bony and the cartilage in this part of the rib for the surgery. So we've just completed with this nasal reconstruction. We've augmented the pyriform rim. Septal extension graft is a dorsal graft. We've had to harvest rib, both the bony and the cartilage in this rib. I'm going to show you how her profile was before we started. So you can see that huge improvement, not just in the nose, but you can observe the position of the upper lip, the position of the cheek, and the place where the nose starts. Okay, so now we're going to show you the front view. Again, you can see this is the Huge improvement. To say she really didn't have a nose, the nose, nasal bones were really, really hypoplastic. So was a septum and the other parts of the nose. Now I'm going to show you the worm side view once. And again, in this view, the pre op you'll be able to appreciate that the nose was literally buried in the face, buried between the eyes and above the lip, and so we've kind of resurrected it. You can see the base of the nose now, and also the tip, and we're gonna show the front here as well.